Hi guys, it's Barnaby for Spurred On. This is another edition of 7 o'clock Spurs on Wednesday. First bit of news today. It's not only us who are interested in Fulham's attacking talent, Moussa Dembele. Uh, according to the standard today, Manchester United are also interested in taking the namesake of our fantastic central midfielder. Tell you a little bit more about him. He's a 19-year-old France under-20 international. And the interesting thing for me in terms of how Spurs like to do their business and what Paul Mitchell looks for, as well as Pochettino in their next young signings, is that he is potentially available in the summer for a tribunal compensation fee. Uh, if you remember, that's exactly what happened with Danny Ings when he moved from Burnley to Liverpool. What happens is if they're a certain age, uh, you, you buy the player and then uh, the money is decided by a tribunal from the FA. So I think that sounds like a really interesting prospect to me. That does sound like the kind of signing that Spurs would be interested in making. And let's face it, it would be great to have two Moussa Dembele's. What could we sing? Mm, could we sing there's only two Moussa Dembele's? Yes, I think we probably could. Second bit of news today. Rumours coming out of the lane and uh, Spurs training ground that Josh Onoma might make his first start for the club for the first team tomorrow night against Monaco in the Europa League. For me, I think this is a fantastic opportunity to blood him, to give him his first start. He's looked good in his substitute appearances both in the Europa League and in the Premiership so far. Just little appearances that he's made. He looks bright, likes to get at people, which I like. Tomorrow against Monaco, we only need a draw to guarantee top of the group. We're already through to the last 32. Give him a start at the lane. Glory, glory night. Give him a chance to show what he's made of. I like the look of the boy. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Should we start him or not? Final bit of news today. Daniel Levy uh, said at a fans forum this week that he specifically was told by Maurizio Pochettino in the summer that he didn't want to buy a defensive midfielder. That's right, if you remember in August, we were all shouting and screaming and hollering that we needed cover for Nabil Bentaleb. But Mo Mopo, uh, Maurizio Pochettino said to Daniel Levy, no, we don't need one because I think I can turn Eric Dyer into a fantastic central defensive midfielder. And by goodness, did he do that. Dyer's having a brilliant, brilliant season. Obviously, it won his first England cap because of his play in central defensive midfielder in midfield. And of course, as we know, Ledley King used to play uh, at the beginning of his career in defensive midfield. And he said that it really helped his central defensive play when he moved back there. I think Eric Dyer will eventually move back there. but. This bit of his career playing in midfield will only help. Guys, what do you think? Do you agree? Let me know in the comments section below. If you disagree, let me know about that as well. Drop the video a like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter, at Spurred on TV. Come on, you Spurs. You up there at the end of the season? We, because of Leicester going up there and Liverpool getting up there and Chelsea not being there, I think we 